12 emeralds. Damn it. Wow. Horsia, where the hell are you? Bitch, where the hell did you go? I didn't bring my lead. You little nasty whore. She's a damn whore. Ah, good day everyone and welcome back to another One Life episode where I literally have one life in this whole entire series and guess what? I'm still kicking it. And last episode, Lizzie and I went on the most risky mission of our one lives and that was to climb up the Alps and retrieve spring water and bring it back to our homes. The only issue is, or was, you couldn't take it in a bucket. So we literally created the world's largest aqueduct and uh, I created a stream that leads to my house, which took five hours. Um, and now I have this gorgeous, beautiful, uh, majestic tree with a spa underneath it. I still need to clear out these trees. These were just kind of like how I was getting the resources for this. Uh, so basically what I'm thinking is this will be like the storefront where people will purchase their entry fee into the spa and then just pass like I'll probably put a desk here with the thing um, they'll be able to come behind the desk and then there'll be a ladder that will take them down into the spa so I need to go make a ladder a bunch of ladders to get straight down into the spa so let's let's go build some okay 54 ladders should be plenty so let's head on back to our spa entrance and let's go take care of our ladder straight down this is kind of dangerous oh look at that what's down there i need some torches this is risky business we're dealing with here all right here we go hello who's there <gasps> oh that's my moat. Okay, cool. So, um, we'll just do this. We'll seal this place up. We won't even realize that this is a thing in the future. Okay, so I want to show you guys a trick that I learned to protect myself while digging down into the deeps. So, what you want to do is stay in the middle of both. So, when I break this, I don't fall down. And when I break that, I don't fall down. So I'm going to do this very slowly, just so I don't risk lava. Now, I should also probably get my water bucket ready along with these, just in case lava does fall down. Oh, I should also be <laughs> building this, huh? Shouldn't I? And I'll also be placing these behind me. Um, but yeah, that's kind of what I'm going to be doing for the next little bit. So I'll catch up with you guys. Um, when this is done. Okay, we've reached to a cave. Um, and I'm a little worried. Not gonna lie. Um, I need to really just hop on down there. Don't think there's anything down there, so I should be safe. So let's just... Oh, it's completely torched up. So perfect. Aha! Here it is! I've made it at last! Okay. So now I just need to climb back up with the ladders. I, I found this way to just be easier to just, as I climb, put the ladder down. Perfect. Okay, let's see how quick. Oh, that's kind of scary. I should put a bucket of water down here just in case. Just in case they plop on down. I don't want them to die, you know? Maybe I'll make it so every, it's only, these that are open perfect okay so now i'm down here in my refreshing place um so yeah basically i'm just gonna clear out this entire area and just kind of open it up and make it super dang cute so once this is all exposed um i'll be back okay welcome back so i think what i'm going to do for decorating the inside of the spa is uh there's these paper blocks which i think are so freaking pretty and it just requires paper and a stick that's literally all it requires so they're the cheapest damn blocks in the world uh so i'm gonna actually not do that many because just by three i'll get 32 each like for one thing so i think 
that's quite a lot. So let's actually just do two more. I think that's actually maybe more than enough, but you can also chisel them. So there's like some paper um, that have roses on them, which I think is so cute. And then uh, let's see what other options we have. I think the cherry wood would look pretty down there. I'm not sure. Actually, no, I don't want to do cherry wood. Let's, um, let's do some dark oak for the siding. And then I think I might have to do a silk touch pickaxe for grass because it doesn't seem like the grass is really growing underground which is fine it's just annoying i don't think i have my chisel i need to get my chisel give me my chisel now there she is oh you guys also commented that there's a faster way to chisel blocks <laughs> excuse me you must be joking right like I spent so long chiseling every damn block that I found, um, but I guess you can do like stacks of chisel, which I mean, I guess it's a good thing because I need to do that. I hear a witch cat down here. I don't like that. So yeah, I want to do silk touch to make this grass grow. There's some demonic stuff going on down here. I need to clear that out because no one wants to hear that. Uh, okay, so I think we should do uh, kind of like should we build back one more i think we should so i'm gonna clear this out one more block let's just do a, a little chisel test i think you have to right click on the chisel we'll figure it out let's see this and then do i put it in here here oh there oh fabulous okay i want to do this we'll do 60 wow that made things so much easier what have i been doing with my life Okay, I think that's going to be there, and then uh, this will kind of be on each corner. That's what I'm going to do, so I'll catch back with you guys once I formulate that. Alrighty, so I've been hard at work working on the spa, and I came to the point where I really need that grass down there because I think it's really gonna make it look beautiful. So we need silk touch to bring grass down there and to make that we need four string, four paper, and a golden pickaxe. So let's get our three gold for the golden pickaxe. We should have the paper and we have the string. So we have everything we need to make this thing uh, which I'm super excited about because I've never had a silk touch pickaxe yet in this whole server so this is gonna be real nice okay so string like this and then four pieces of papel there we go oh fabulous so does this have to go on a pickaxe it probably does you know it's probably better to just do that um i should just put it on this one i don't care much for it okay silk touch <gasps> okay let's go outside and see if it works and then we'll go down and I'll show you an update of how things are looking, but let's leave our property. I also um, had to plant a dark oak tree because I need some dark oak wood and I don't feel like traveling. So hopefully that will grow soon, but let's leave our property and get some dirt somewhere else. I also need to get some replacement for stuff like that. So this is perfect. I hope it works with, um, with a pickaxe. It should, right? Ah, <gasps> it did. Okay, I'm just gonna get a bunch of this. Perfect, I have a full stack of 64 grass. So that's more than enough and I can do some patchwork around my house. So let's head on into the spot. This honestly is life-changing. Like I can't believe I get to just come into my amazing, beautiful tree, go down into the depths and just heal myself whenever I need to. Okay, so here's an update of what it's looking like. It's so freaking cute, I'm obsessed. I think I'm gonna make the ceiling though, uh, kind of like a triangle so it's just not like a flat surface um so that's gonna take a while which is frustrating because i'm over this stuff i'm sick of building i just want to play <sighs> okay so let's dig up this dirt place our grass blocks and then uh, we'll place some peonies peon peonies peon me peonies cute they're kind of like a little lopsided but you know what that's just how that's just how it is <laughs> Those look perfect. Why are these janky? Ugh, frustrating. Alrighty, so I've been hard at work at decorating and I'm excited to show you all what I have so far. So 
what I'm thinking here, before we go down into the depths and I show you what I finished with the spa, I want to explain this area. So this is where people will enter in and there will be a, whatchamacallit, a thing. What is it called? A block, something. Vending, vending block. So kind of like what Lizzie had at her store, it will have this um, right here. And I think what I'm gonna do is exchange uh, whatever it is, I think I'm gonna start with like a gold block for a piece of paper and then they have to put their tickets in here Which will be the paper. I'll put a sign that says tickets go here with an arrow pointing down and then they will have access into the spa Now I don't really know redstone I think it would be cool if once they threw it in this would open but I don't know how to do that so maybe I'll figure that out for another time, but uh, they'll come down here and I'm gonna replace all this cobblestone with pink just to make it super cute and uh, yeah get ready for the spa reveal <gasps> welcome welcome to Joey's glorious spa oh my gosh oh, I'm so happy with it um, so yeah this is what the spa is you hop in here and you just you just chill you can literally take off all your armor and just relax for a bit um, I don't have enough space in my inventory, but yeah, I'm super proud of this. I think it's so cool and I think people are going to love it, especially if they have more than two hearts missing. They can just hop in here, revive themselves and feel so much better about themselves. So let's head back upstairs and let's make the machine core. Uh, oh, also just to kind of explain things. Yeah, I put these, um, fairy lights. They're like fairy light lanterns um, all around here. And then I made these windows that kind of make it look like it's outdoors uh, with some flowers, some peonies. And then I just placed some pink tulips on the outskirts. So I don't know, I just love it. I think it's so cute. I can't wait to come here and just, you know, relax and enjoy the spa. Uh, so let's head up and let's figure out how we make this bending block. Let's head inside where we know it's perfectly safe. So let's see what we have to do to make this bending block. So we need glass, emeralds, we don't have any emeralds, and a redstone thing, so we need nether quartz, good thing we still have that. Um, we also need a machine core. Okay, I'm gonna make everything but the emeralds, and then we'll go figure out how we're gonna get emeralds. <sighs> okay, so I have everything but the two emeralds. So we, oh, hello sir, with your helmet on. Where is Fred? Fred's not in the front. I know George is back here. George, where is your brother Fred? He needs to be protecting. I don't know where he went. Did he die? Can they die in water by touching water? Did they rust? I don't know. Uh, okay, so we need to go to a village and go find some villagers and see what they want to trade and um, trade with them. And I feel, I feel brave. I'm just going out here. Sorry, sir. Oh, you want to... Oh, you can't even hurt me, can you? Get over here. You don't even hurt me. I'm brave. Wow, he didn't even take any damage on me. I'm a badass, damn it! Let's take Corsia and let's go to a village and find out what they want to trade. Come on, Horsia, we're going for a gorgeous ride out into the wilderness. Let's go find out what these villagers want. Oh, there's my dark oak tree. Too late. Okay, so there's a village over here, not too far from us. <sighs> Why isn't there a bridge? Why isn't there a bridge? Why haven't I built a bridge yet? What have I done? Where are my things? Where's my sword? Okay, you know what, Horsia? You just wait here. I don't even honestly need you. I can't believe we're gonna get an emerald. We haven't even got one this whole series. That's crazy talk. All right, villagers, give me all your emeralds and give them now and give them good. Hello? Yoo-hoo! Anyone home? Where the hell are all the villagers? They must have, oh, I hear one. Hello? <gasps> oh, inside there, sir. Sir, are you okay? Have you been trapped in there this whole time? Huh. I think I'll keep you trapped in there so you can't ever leave. Hello. 15 string for one emerald. I only have five on me right now, but I'm gonna go home and I'm gonna go get some cotton and make a bunch of string. Oh, you sir, hello. 18 string, <gasps> 21 coal. 21 coal, are you kidding me? 
Um, sir, if you could just hold on for two minutes. I'm just gonna go home real quick and get all the coal I can because that is a steal and a half. Oh my gosh, he doesn't even realize. Wow, 21 coal, what a deal. All right, let's go get our Stone Coal Steve Austin. Okay, there's a bridge now. Also, a lot of you guys were yell yelling at me because I didn't know how to jump. Haha, <laughs> guess, guess who's the master now? <laughs> <Here's mine. laughs> that is actually so much easier. So let's just take a whole fat stack of these. And let's, oh, I really need to just clear out my inventory. Okay, let's go see what this guy, how many he'll trade. Because I want to get all the coal, give him all my coal. Take it all. Everything that you could possibly want. Oh, I love that jump move. Why didn't you guys tell me sooner? You actually did tell me a long time ago and I just never listened. Hello, head on up there. Okay, Horsia, you wait here. Don't fall, die, die, don't die. Hello, sir. I'm here to scam you. You said something about a uh, coal? Here. Ooh, here, no, take more. Take all the coal you could have ever wanted in your life. Yes, no, it's all for you. Oh my gosh, he doesn't even realize I'm scamming him. Oh no, he's out. He's out of, oh, seven for a fishing rod, raw fish for a cooked fish. Oh, oh, and an emerald? What, you, you're you a master chef or something? Okay, Mr. Fisherman, I've gotten what I needed out of you. Now go run along with your, you know, particles and whatnot, and you. <gasps> Do you do the same thing? Oh, hell yeah. Just take, take it all. 12 emeralds, damn it! Wow! Horsia, where the hell are you? Bitch, where the hell did you go? I didn't bring my lead. You little nasty whore. She's a damn whore. Oh! She's always running off. You know what, I am just, I've just had it up to here with her. You need to go. Girl, girl, I don't even know where you are. I'm going on top of this house to find out where she is. I don't even see her. Did she die? I bet she's in that damn cave. I guarantee you that's where she went or in that pit of lava. Hello, Horsia, if you're freaking in here, just come out, come out wherever you are. If she found her way in there, could you imagine how crazy that would be? No, she didn't. I don't know where she, she went. She vanished into thin air. Well, she's no longer with us at this point. Sucks to be her. She stole my diamond armor and she probably went off to go find, I don't even know what. Oh, there's a cave down here. Hey girl, you in here? If you are, good luck, cause I'm not coming. Actual nighttime, nowhere to be found. Hmm. Good luck out there in the world, sister. Stole my damn diamond armor. Hmm, must be nice. Whore, Portugal. Let's go home and let's make this damn bending block. None of my horse are ever getting armor ever again. They don't deserve it. Okay, let's make this some blending block. Blending. <laughs> and Fred, Fred's nowhere to be found. Why am I leaving all my doors open? I'm just getting a little too relaxed, aren't I? Okay, so we have this, we have two emeralds, and then we put the machine core and then some glass. Perfect, we have our advanced bending block. So now I think we just go over, oh, well let's sleep, and then we'll go over to our store and, We'll tell people what it costs. Okay, I'm gonna place the bending block right there. And then, how does this work? Okay, selling. Do I select what I'm selling? Or do I have to put it in there? Because I'm selling paper, which is essentially a ticket. Sell paper, and then select. Let's look up gold block. Yes, I think a gold block. That will suffice. I need, I need diamonds. That's what I'm charging, a diamond block. Select, and then do I lock it in? Okay, I'll lock it in, and then I just need to bring paper. Oh no! Yeah, no, I'm selling that and I'm buying blocks, okay. <laughs> I was like, I meant to have a diamond block. Okay, so I need to get some paper to put in there so people can keep coming back, get their little tickets, throw it on in there. 
Okay, I got paper and I got signs, so I'm super excited to go over here and open my business. So we'll put a sign here. Tickets go down here. Tickets to spot go down here. <gasps> Perfect! And then I just need to put something here for spa tickets. So I feel like I might need a piece of pink wood to put the, actually a sign can just go here. Tickets to Joey's, oh crap, I forgot to do colors. Uh, tickets to Joey's day spa right there, oh my gosh. And then the tickets go down here and then they enter. Oh, fabulous, and then they go down there. Okay, perfect. Oh my gosh, I'm so freaking excited for this. This is gonna be incredible, oh my gosh. Wow. I'm, I don't even know. Like, I feel like a businessman. Oh, cool! Oh, okay. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed this episode of One Life. I can't believe I'm a businessman. I have a spa, a day spa. What the heck? Who would have ever thought I'd have a day spa in One Life? Well, I do. Uh, so if you enjoyed this video and you want to see more of One Life, please give this video a thumbs up and I will see you all tomorrow. Good damn bye.